feel good. Oh, suck it in. Good morning. Hello. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday. Welcome to vlog 20. 20 weeks of you watching us. That's crazy. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for all the nice comments in our last video. As I well. know. They're so nice. It's nice to be nice to the nice. What's that from? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it's wow. like my chest says. Be kind. Oh. We were watching um, this other YouTuber last night, and she was going off about how, like, she always has to watch what she says. Yeah. She'll refilm things so many times because she knows that she's gonna get hate comments from it, and I'm like. If people are actually analyzing your life that bad, yeah. like, then that viewer is the one that has the problem, not you. Facts. Because you're just doing your own thing. Yeah. But they're just sitting there behind their computer like, why did she do that? We have coffee and a brekkie Sammy. Thanks, Tyler. It looks good. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm excited. If there was avocado on this, that'd be bomb. Ooh, uh, dang it. That was really set on the top. Get to Del Taco. They got a new thing called Frisia Free, free shavaka do. What's the plan today? Well, I think we're just gonna go to the gym and then hang out and then probably just do dinner tonight because it's birthday weekend. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> My birthday's on Monday, but we're gonna celebrate today. We're gonna eat and then we'll see you guys in a little bit. Yeah, when we look a little bit better. Yeah, I feel ratchet. All right, see you in a bit. Bone apple teeth. <laughs> So fun. The funnest. Hello, everyone. All right, tell them what we're doing. Well, it's a few hours later. It is. From, from, from breakfast. But we went to the gym. Yes. But now we're back. <laughs> and we're, back. we're having, a, we're gonna do a review because we know how much you guys love our reviews <laughs> and our hauls and our OOTDs. So we're just gonna keep them going. <laughs> you guys were begging for it, so we're gonna provide. Here it is. We're in the Bud Light, Bud Light Seltzer Hard Sodas. Yeah. I saw these on TikTok yeah. like two days ago maybe, mm -hmm. and I was like, we gotta try these because I heard they're actually very good. The flavors are citrus soda, classic cola, orange soda, and cherry cola. Mm -hmm. Which ones do you think are gonna be your favorite of the four? I mean, I love cherry cola, like cherry Pepsi or cherry Coke, gotcha. so maybe cherry. I don't see how I'm gonna like classic cola. I just don't see how I'm gonna like it. Wait, is there cherry in there? Yeah, there's cherry. Oh, cola. okay. Cherry. I'm going with cherry. I want to say I was gonna say cherry, but because you're saying cherry, I'm gonna say orange. I'm gonna. Just, I do love orange crush. We'll just see. Though. We'll see. I don't know. Basically the same, like nutritional value mm -hmm. as any other seltzer. So it's 100 calories. I think there's what two carb. Like, pretty standard for a seltzer. Five percent alcohol. Same. Which is the yeah. same as Zero Sugar and uh, White Claw. Yeah. And it is seltzer. This is not, not beer or anything like, like that. Flashback to vacation. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was funny. I give this a 5 out of 10. Wait. These are beer. These aren't seltzers. That makes way more sense. Because I was tasting this, I was like, this is not <laughs> what I'm expecting at all. You ready to try these? Let's do it. Voila. Bone apple teeth. How are we gonna rate them? Do you wanna do one out of 10 for each one? Yeah. And then we'll classify which one we like the best. Yeah. So we'll do one through 10, 10 being we like this, we love it, we want some more of it. We tried so hard. <laughs> Number one being throw trash. this crap out the window. Absolutely trash. <laughs> right. Throw it into the intersection. <laughs> so this is, like I said, the citrus. Mm -hmm. This gives me St. Patrick's Day vibes Ooh, for some reason. I love St. Like, Patrick's Day. The, Oh, it the citrus does. down there just kind of reminds me of yeah. a clover. So I feel like if this is good, you can come back here. This could be my. This is good. This could be my St. Patty's Day beverage. That, that would be fun. All right, citrus. Here we go. I hope it doesn't explode. It won't. Watch it just go everywhere. <laughs> this is not going to be your beverage of choice. It tastes fake. It tastes like sugar water. It's like artificial grossness. It, it tastes like if you put sweet in low packets in water. Ew, it. that's nasty. Ugh. God. Don't recommend. Try, uh, three. You wanna do three? I'll do three too. I think we can give that one a three. There's no citrus. It's just sweet. It's just, yeah. Which I'm worried about this one. This one is the classic cola. So, I don't know. I don't know about this one. 
I feel like it's gonna be good. You think so? Because I feel like when you drink, like, you know, like when you have McDonald's <coughs> pops for some reason, they always hit different. I feel yeah, like McDonald's like, soda is good. Right. I feel like it's so carbonated that that makes it all, kind of taste like there's alcohol already yeah. in it. Oh, this one I don't think is clear. That's not clear. That's brown. That is brown. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, that makes it even worse. I'm scared. All right, here we go. Let's try it. That's not bad. <laughs> That's actually, I mean, it's kind of what I expected, but tastes better than I expected. I don't know. I don't know how to explain that. It tastes like a Coke Zero. Yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking. If you've ever had Coke Zero. Yeah. This is Coke Zero. And I don't like soda in general, which maybe that's a problem because we're having literally sodas basically, but I like that. This is bomb though. I give that an eight or seven. I go eight. All right, I'll do eight. Uh, yeah. I think it's an eight. She's an eight. Next. She's a runner. She's a track <coughs> star. This is the orange. There you go. There you go. Orange, cute. Yeah. I feel like Bud Light does a very good job with their cans. Their fall sweater pack is cute. Yeah. These are cute. Those not Bud Light, Bud Light Bud beers <laughs> thing that we had. Wait. These are beer. Those were cute. Those they, were cute. They have good colors that pop. I feel like. Graphic designers. Mm -hmm. This is orange, actually. Oh wow. I know. Ooh, I think I'm gonna like this. This is the one I said was gonna be my favorite. So. Wait. Shut the. Open that door and close it. Shut the front door. Oh my god. These are bangers. That's so good. This is fire. I would say nine. It's definitely better than that one, so nine. I'd say nine. I'd, I'd go nine. I want maybe like a dash more orange. Yeah, maybe. All right. <coughs> Last no, one. My fave. This one's the cherry cola. It's be Ty's. I just love cherry pop. Okay, this one's brown again. Like cherry Dr. Pepper just hits different. Try it. Yeah. Holy oh, mother that's of good. Pearl. That's good. That's good. Mother of Pearl. 10. I don't Absolutely think so. 10. No, 10. I don't I'm think so. 110. 110%. I kind of want to now change my. I want to do this one 7, this one 8, and this one 9. And this is my order. Okay. Okay, let's do our orders and then we'll kind of. Rating we'll, time. Rating time. There we go. I'll start and then you can do yours. That works. All right. I think we can all both agree. Citrus. Trash, absolute trash, still a three. Yeah. That's last place. Classic cola, it was good. It was good. However, I just like having flavors. Flavors was much better. So I, I think I'm gonna give this one a seven, a solid seven. So this is in third place. I think you were right. I still think this was second. I wanna give this one an eight. Okay. Because I think it does need a little bit more orange. So this is second place, and then third place, or first place is the cherry cola because this is absolute fire. I give this a nine. I don't give it a 10 only because of the fact that I still can't drink more than a few of these at a time. Well, right. You know, it's like, I, I think after two or three of these, my stomach would be like, all right, enough. It's just sweet. It is. But it's still good. It's really good. So that's my order. Okay. I think you may have the same order, but. So this is also my order, but my ratings, I think cherry, I'm giving a 10 out of 10. Boom. Fireworks. Orange, I'm gonna give it a nine. Okay. But like you said, I want that little like yeah, punch, but I don't mind not having it. No, like, it's not bad. It's okay. Yeah. Classic, I'll give it a seven. I was pleasantly surprised. I was surprised by it. I'll yeah. do seven and then I'm sticking with three. Trash, <laughs> absolute trash. This is sweet and low water. But lights out, sir, if you're watching, which we know you're not, missed opportunity on We're this one. We're coming for you. However, <laughs> these three, you did well. You did well. Better than your, you redeemed yourself for your swall, your swall, your fall sweater pack. We tried to do a review of those and they were just so bad anyway, so it wasn't fun. It was just like, <laughs> well, that was our Bud Light Seltzer, actual <laughs> seltzer, summer, hard cola review. spring review? No, hard cola, right? Yeah, These are cola. colas. Hard, hard cola review. Hard soda. Hard soda. Hard Something. soda. Fine. I feel get like that was a good one. Get them at your local closest beer distributor. If you're in PA. If you're in Pennsylvania, yeah. but if you're anywhere else just, in the country, just go to the grocery store. Go to the grocery store. <laughs> we're we gonna go to dinner yet. No, we have to figure that out. Okay, well, we'll let you know when we figure it out. So we'll see you guys in a little bit. Bye. Just drinking orange cola. Orange cola? Yum. I feel like these sodas would be good if you're having like fried food. I can see that. Like Chick-fil-A or like. <laughs> 
if you're like if you're at like a restaurant or something, eating like a fried chicken sandwich or like wings or something, I mm. feel like these would go really well with it. Hmm. So I feel like usually you drink pop when you eat like pizza or like fried foods. That makes sense. All right, we figured out where we're going to dinner. Tell them. It's called Sueño. Is it? Yeah. Oh yeah yeah yeah. I forgot what we did in Mexican. It's on South Thirteenth Street. All right, he's doing his hair. I was fixing my hair in the, in the view, as we're vlogging in the viewfinder. I was fixing my hair. Anyway, um, yeah, it's on South Thir South Thirteenth Street, about two blocks south from City Hall. Oh, okay. So we're just gonna take the train there and get off at Thirteenth Street and just go. We needed Mexican food in our lives. Naturally. When do we not? We were going back and forth. We're like, we don't want Italian. We didn't want American because I feel like all we eat is American food. And Mediterranean sounded good, but all the restaurants that we looked at didn't do anything for us yeah. or they didn't have great times available. It's like for six o'clock or 10 o'clock. So True. Mexican it is. <laughs> but it's not El Camino, so it's different. So it's not the same. I'm going to get a Margi though. For True. sure. We were just jamming out to Lizzie McGuire. That was fun. Uh, yeah. Then we put on The Greatest Showman, mm -hmm. and then we put on Mamma Mia. It was just a musical kind of night. Let us know what your favorite DCOM was down below, if you're <sighs> of our age. Wait, Smart House, 100%. I loved it. I, Ooh, Luck of the Irish. I was gonna say that, or you don't like this one, and I kind of forget the name of it. It's the one where the girl has Luck of the, the Irish. book. She has a book. You talk about this one. When did it come out? Because I don't remember this on. one. Look. Yeah, I have to Google. I forget the name of it, it's, which is sad because it's my favorite one. <gasps> okay, I just, I take that back. This, that one that I'm trying to find is not my favorite. My oh, favorite's no. Motocross. It was like teenage, like throw you through a loop. Like what's happening? <gasps> read it and weep. Re yeah, so it is that's that. the yeah, one. Read it and weep. Yeah, that's what it is. This is a freaking yeah, that one. awesome movie. I liked it because she had this laptop, but it would like swivel. It was like one of the first like yoga books kind of thing where you could fold it into a laptop and then do a tablet. Mm -hmm. And I thought she was so flipping cool. And I really wanted one. I was so jealous of her. That's funny. And I, that's why I really like it. But also, but motocross was the best. That was, that was an okay It's impeccable. It's honestly great acting. I don't know how they didn't go farther in their careers. <laughs> anyway, that's it. All right. Oh, this battery is dying. We need to get another one. We'll see you on the road. Mwah. Coming back at you from it's the streets. It's freaking cold right now. How did you like Sueño? It was really good. Yeah, honestly, we, it was great. Honestly, great. I don't know if I should say this, but I think it may be better than El Camino. I, okay, I asked Chris this and I was like, is this competition for El Camino? It, I definitely think it is. The quesadilla was bomb. Yeah. Also, the quesadilla though, it, El Camino was bomb too. So, all right, we're on to our next adventure. <laughs> We're not sure where we're going yet, but we'll yeah. figure it out. We're still bopping around. Cause I won't stay awake till morning. I won't stay another night. If you're feeling something for me, I say it now. Cause I can't wait for you forever. Sunday. 
Happy Sunday. <laughs> this is all we've been doing, and it's 4.30. It's 4.30. And we've done literally nothing. Absolutely nothing today. I've done nothing. Chris has done stuff. Yeah, a little bit. Nothing crazy, though. We went to Woody's. We went to Woody's. It's fun. Yeah. The music sucked at first. I know. But then it got better. It did get better. I think the DJ finally read the room. <laughs> This guy had uh, his phone up on his forehead and it said, play ABBA. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, it I was agree funny. with him. I know, it was funny. I would have loved to hear ABBA. But this is our Sunday. Yeah, this is pretty much what we're doing today. I want pizza for dinner. <gasps> Can we please get it? Yeah. Anyway, so I am actually packing tonight. Uh, I'm going to Dallas. So I'm going to go visit some family and see friends and stuff. So I'm packing and then... I'm almost done, so it shouldn't take very long, and I guess we're just gonna chill and watch some TVs and eat pizza. Pizza. I mean, we'll tell you how the pizza went. All right, girlies. All right, see you in a bit. Have a great Sunday. Uh. Pizza's here. Pizza, pizza. Yum. <laughs> so excited. <laughs> Look how good this looks. Wow. Do you remember what it was called? Uh, Chicken Supremo. What's on it? So it's a white pizza with chicken, tomatoes, a balsamic glaze, and then just like a regular cheese. Ty got an Italian sub or hoagie, and I got the pizza steak. I know, we're so hungry. But we're just gonna eat and then chill. It's bedtime. Bedtime. It's 10 p.m. Yes. We're exhausted. I am very tired. I, know, I fell asleep watching 24. <laughs> It's time to go to sleep. Sleepy time, because we have to get up early. He's going to take me to the airport in the morning, so. Yeah. yeah, it's been like a gross day. Yeah, however, it melted all the snow, so I'm That's fine true. with that. That is true. My birthday's in two hours, so that's fun. Oh, happy birthday. <laughs> but I'm going to be asleep by then. It's a wrap on the weekend. It's a wrap on the weekend. We'll probably, have, I think we're going to vlog at least one more, maybe two more days. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We'll figure it out. Yeah, we'll have to figure out some logistics. Yeah, but well, we'll see you guys in the morning. Bright and early. Yay. Good, Good morning. morning. Oh, Hello. the lighting sucks. It does suck. But we're in the car. We're in the car, about to leave for the airport. It's 6.47 on the way to the airport. And another year older. Another year older. Yay. Happy birthday. What is that? It is your birthday period. It's a statement of fact. Not even an exclamation point? This is more professional. Thanks. <laughs> the big 2 8. Fun times. Random. Anyway. I feel like 27 was more random than 28, though, so I'm okay with it. That's true. I like even numbers, so. And this one adds up to my lucky number, so that's good, too. Alright, we gotta go. Yeah, we gotta Let's go. go. See you guys later. We'll see ya. Mwah. Made it through security. This is actually the first time I've ever been stopped uh, for bag check in years, I think. I forgot I had a can in there, a can of hairspray in there that was like, it's still smaller than a normal one, but I forgot it's not my travel one. I just didn't think about taking it out before I left ties. So that was the only thing I was taking away, but all good. I'm heading to my gate now. We have about 20 to 25 minutes until we board. So I'm hoping to grab something to either to eat or maybe even a coffee before getting on the plane, but we'll see. I don't know if I'm gonna have time. I've never been in this part of the terminal before, so I don't really know what's here. So let's take a look. Say you love me. Say you don't. Just give me something so I can move. Hey everyone, I made it on the plane, so we should be taking off pretty soon. I'm on the way to Dallas. See you in a few weeks, Philly. Dallas. 
Ugh, that was a long flight, but we made it. Um, I think I'm gonna grab a coffee real quick before I hit a bad claim. Your boy is so tired. Okay, so there's this new, I guess it's a docu-series. I don't know what you would call it, but it's about the Hype House, which if you don't know what Hype House is, it's just a bunch of TikTokers who live in a house together. And that's what they called the house. And I was like, just gonna pick it just, just because I was like, eh, it's something to watch. I'm obsessed with it. It is so good. I don't know, I never, I really wasn't into Hype House or any of those TikTokers, but now I'm like so invested in them. <laughs> I think there's like eight episodes and I'm already on like episode six or seven or something like that. Oh my god, this line for Chick-fil-A is so long. I forget how much in the South people love Chick-fil-A. Like I said, I'm gonna grab some coffee real quick. And then I think my mom's picking me up. So we're gonna go get a baggage claim, get my bags, and then go see my mom. Hello everyone. I made it to Texas. I am here. I'm about to drive, which I don't normally do, which if you've seen our vlogs before, this is normally when Ty would be like, oh everyone, put your seatbelts on, Chris is driving, this is scary. Even though I'm not a bad driver, Tyler. I am going to get my hair cut real quick, and then I'm gonna hit the gym before I go see my aunt real quick, cause she wanted to see me. And then I think after that, I don't really know. <laughs> I'm either gonna go to dinner with my family or I'm gonna go see my friend Taylor. It's her birthday also. Uh, we go get drinks or something like that. Hello everyone. Look who I'm with. Hi guys. Say hi. This is Taylor. You actually have Hi. met her once before, but for like a brief second. I don't even think you talked on the vlog. The last time we were in town, <laughs> when we went to, uh, where did we go? We went to Gloria's. We were here for Thanksgiving. Yeah. She was in it, but we didn't really say anything. It well, was like a quick. <laughs> we're going for drinks for our birthday. We're gonna go to this place called Taverna. They have a happy hour, so. We're here for that. We're gonna go to that they first. Super cute. I know. Here, look at it. So cute. And then I don't know where we're gonna go after that, but we'll let you guys know. They probably won't. Probably won't. <laughs> she knows. She knows. for the night. I'm honestly shocked that we're vlogging right now. We had a good night. We just got- We had a better than good night. We had a bizarre, well, the last 30 minutes was weird. We, so we were at this bar, we started a tab, and then they couldn't find our tab. We're happy about that though. So I didn't have to pay for any of the last few drinks we had, he which said, was so you weird. Paid. What are you talking about? And I was like, oh, I was like, I didn't pay. And also I don't have any kind of receipt or any, whatever, it's fine. Out really well for and it us. worked out for us. Maybe that's a good birthday gift for us. Happy birthday to us. Happy birthday. We're going home now. It was fun. And that's it. And good night. Oh. Hello. Welcome. It's just me. So, as you know, Chris is in Texas. So, you get me for the whole week and him separately. Isn't that fun? This is very low. Let me please pause while I fix this. Oh, all right, that looks better. Welcome to Monday evening. It is 8.36 to be exact. I just got home, naturally. You know, I feel like after I leave work and then like the time I go to bed, it just is like flies by. But then when you're at work, it's just so slow. So I don't understand that. Somebody explain that to me. We're gonna make some dinner. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think, well, we have the leftover pizza. I don't really know if I want that. Maybe I'll make some ramen, just kind of rough it. We're gonna figure it out, I guess. So I guess we'll have a little little chat time while I cook and figure out what to make. Maybe I'll, I'll see you in a few minutes, you know, while we're trying to scramble some something for dinner.
All right, so I kind of figured something out. I thought I had ramen, but I don't. So we're gonna improvise and do rice instead. Don't come at me for this. This is gonna be rice, scrambled eggs, and then I have frozen meatballs, so I'm gonna cook those, and that'll be like my meat, my protein, so. You, hey, donut, come here, you. There you go. Get out, out! Sounds actually kind of disgusting, but it's basically all I have right now besides the pizza, but I just don't want the pizza, you know what I mean? It's kind of gonna be like a fried rice in a way, just a jankier version, and there's also no vegetables because I don't have any of those, so. We really need to go to the grocery store, don't we? Let's get to whipping up. This can be my cooking tip for the week. Always preheat your pans because sometimes the reason your food sticks is because your pan isn't preheated. So the best way to prevent that is to preheat. And if you're using oil or anything, preheat the pan, then put the oil in and let that heat up and then put your food in. It'll just prevent stickage all around. So that's your tip of the week. Back to cooking. Start mixing the eggs. How was your day, everybody? You know, how was your Monday? Happy Monday? Good Monday? Much scary Monday? I'm gonna be involved in you guys' lives. I'll tell you what happened in my life today. Monday was actually pretty good, productive. We have a lot going on this week, actually. We have our automotive ISO audit coming up, which probably means nothing to anybody, but I guess the word audit could be triggering to people because anytime you get audited, nobody wants to be audited. Hopefully it goes smoothly. And I found out today that I got approved for a work phone. So I'll have two phones. So you can call me Tyler Two Phones now if you want to, or actually you probably shouldn't call me that. But if I don't answer one, don't call me on the other one. <laughs> I'm sure that nobody wants to see the finished product for this, so I might just cut it off here and then see you after I eat because I'm sure nobody wants to see this. So bye for now. Okay, we're back. Showered, made my lunch, packed my gym bag. We're good to go for tomorrow. Now it's time to do something exciting. So, as you guys know, I am going back to school and today was the first day of classes. Yay! So, I'm gonna log on, probably watch some YouTube while I'm doing this and see what we're up to. So, probably catch you guys tomorrow. I'll actually, take you to work with me because I did forget you at home today. I was in the car and going down the street and I was like, crap, forgot the camera, but it's okay. I'll take you tomorrow and we'll see what we can get into tomorrow. So that's it for me tonight, I guess. So good night, see you tomorrow. Get some good sleep, sweet dreams, all that good stuff. Hello everyone. Last night was so fun. I'm actually back in the same area that I was in yesterday. Uh, I was just at Starbucks. I was actually editing this video because uh, I want to get as much of this vlog edited because tonight I have to figure out how to get the rest of the footage from Tyler since we're both separate right now. I don't have the other camera to get the other footage. So we're gonna have to figure that out tonight. I don't think I'm gonna vlog much else today just because I think this video is already gonna be long enough. So if I don't talk to you guys the rest of the day, love you guys and then I will see you Close out, which is gonna be interesting. I still don't even know how we're gonna do this close out, but I guess we'll figure it out. Oh, welcome back. All right, hello, happy Thursday. Today is actually my two year work anniversary. Yay! But I'm wearing a Canadian tuxedo today. Well, you can see jean jacket, top, just jeans, white shoes. I thought that, hey, maybe I'll look a little bit nicer today for work. Figured I have a few minutes before my meeting, so I'd have a little story time, I guess. Has anybody else been having like just weird ass dreams lately? It's like, it seems like every night it's, oh, I look so short. It's like every night it's a, something new, you know? Like either it takes me a while to fall asleep and then I finally fall asleep and then it's just weird dreams or it's like I'll sit there and just 
stare at the ceiling and hear just weird ass noises and then I'd finally fall asleep and then my dream is kind of like based off of that but it's just it's weird like last night I had a dream about like my family came over and I sat there and tried different hot sauces like wh what what <laughs> like why <laughs> and then there's been for the past like few weeks a couple of nights it's like I woke up screaming because um, I thought like I was being murdered, I was being chased, like it's just weird. And then the other one, like I was at work and our computer systems got hacked and I was like the one that had to try and stop it and I couldn't figure it out. So then I woke up screaming because of that and like, what's happening? Like is Mercury and Gatorade again or like what's going on, you know? Hello everyone. All right, we are doing the closeout. I'm about to pitch it to Ty, but I wanted to let you guys know I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, I know this was a different vlog this week, a little weird. We're not together, but you know, we're just trying to figure out this whole channel in general. So hopefully, you guys still liked this one. Mwah. See you guys in a minute in my part of the closeout. Take it, Ty. That's it for this week, I guess, folks. So let me do this. Let me put you up here. Close out here. All right. You know the deal. Made it this far. You're a true one. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And don't forget to press the notification button so you get a notification every time I post a video, which is every Wednesday. We'll see you next week. Thank you everybody for coming back. Hi to the new folks. Thank you for coming back to the old folks, or the returning folks, and we'll see you next week. Have a great weekend, everybody. All right, love you. Bye. Bye.